9 inches across or around so it's a little over 12 inches high and it's got a steel cable on it which is where you hang it you get in the box see this steel cable is also about a foot long it looks like so it is green I do think they have a different color if you want that one like I said you can see how long this cable is it does feel like it's rubber coated it's kind of nice it's also got this little cap on here to cover this you can see the the weight when squirrels jump on here just makes this slide down and blocks these holes so they can't get any food and it does cover all of them as you can see and then when they jump off it goes back up to bird shield to get it i guess if some bigger birds jump on here they might also jump down a little bit but i don't think they really weigh enough you see that spring's not too bad and when you fill this, you just lift this whole thing up. And then you take this spring out of here. And it opens it up here. So you can just build a, dump your food in there. It should be pretty simple, pretty easy. I mean, it's actually kind of fast compared to some of the other ones I have. It's also got holes in the bottom here. So if water, anything does get in here, hopefully that moisture goes and drains out. You might have to like unclog these occasionally, depending on what kind of feed you're using. I mean, a lot of times it turns kind of like the dust when you get towards the bottom. It might clog these holes. I don't see this. Yeah, this doesn't come off here. So maybe a toothpick or something to shove in there to clean these out if you need to. Other than that, I like it. Seems pretty well built. You do, when you put this back on, you do have to make sure you get these leaves in the right spot. So that when it goes down, it covers that up. Make sure you get that spring in there right. I just kind of threw it on there. You have to be a little careful, I guess. You just throw it back on there. And there's a slot up here because this peg is flat. So you want to make sure you get that through the hole up there to make sure you get this on right. That kind of goes along with getting these in the right spot. If you don't get it on there right, this lid doesn't go on there right. Like I said, you can see how this is slotted. So you got to make sure you get it matched up with the slots on the on the top here and get this hose back out here it's like this hanger so that way it slides on this post you can't just throw it on there like i did to start with it does take a little thinking but you said you get that on there right all the holes covered up right slides up and down here okay i like it you should get it like i said this is pretty easy to fill up so you just lift this up dump it in there i use a little dixie cup but I do have a scoop you could use too. So mine's a little bigger than this. It fills up really quick, but you gotta have it over the can where the food is. So it overflows or spills off the side. You don't lose it. Pretty simple, pretty easy. It does hold about two pounds of bird seed, they said. You see, I do have a little bigger stuff in here, some sunflower seeds for the bigger birds. But it should stop the squirrels from getting in there. Like I said I'm liking this so far. So it's down pretty easy. I do have it filled all the way up so it doesn't get in the way of the spring. Works perfect. Like it. <laughs> 